Hey, my lovely people. Everybody in the back, in the front, in the side, to the side, don't forget that I'm running a special. I'm doing the $15 shout out in video and community post. It'll be going till Friday. Check out my community post for more details. Guys, invest in yourself. Let's grow together. Usually it is $25, but I have made a deal. So take advantage of the special offer while you can. I love working with other content creators. I love watching people grow. If there's anything I can do to help you, this is one thing I can do. I can offer a shout out. Let's get right into this reaction, baby. Baby, 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 baby. Ooh, wait. So we knew the streets was hot, y'all, but I had to make a separate video for this one because this one really <laughs> caught my attention. I mean, there was a lot of, you know, things being thrown out yesterday um, amongst the ladies, but we have to get into it. So the number one thing, let's get into this first. It was alleged that um, Amaya was not Phillip's uh, child. A lot of people had questions. I've always said that I think she looks like Asia's children personally, you know, but no, neither here nor there. Jasmine decided, boom, shakalaka, here goes the proof. She dropped the DNA test to let everybody know that Amaya is Philip. So at least that clears the air. I mean, that's the only receipt that she really came out with because, I mean, that is a heck of an allegation, right? So I guess I would have proved that to shut somebody up too. Uh, that's just me. All right. But mm -mm. girl, girl, there was a lot more going on in these streets that you still haven't addressed. You have done some subliminal uh, side shade and some things of that nature. But honey, when I tell you the fire, the fire that rumbles inside, okay, the boom shakalaka is when Chrissy said that when Jasmine was pregnant, okay, Chris wanted absolutely nothing to do with her having a baby whatsoever. I can't make it up, y'all. It's in the receipts. Now, here go the receipts. Now, y'all know I'm not going to read the receipts down to the uh, nitty gritty. But pretty much it says, girl, ever since I told him I was pregnant, usually we lay down and we cuddle and he holds me and everything like that. But he just is going to bed and pushing me away. She's also telling Chrissy, you know, hey, I really don't want to deal with all this stress during my pregnancy. So maybe it's time for me to abort the mission. Maybe it's time for me to jump ship. Maybe it's time for me to go. She's also saying that he's been only acting like that since she told him that she was pregnant. Oh, man, ain't that a mouthful. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Now, let me just say this. We all knew that that was something that was going on. I mean, come on. When you sit down and you go to tell your um boyfriend or as she calls husband, hey, I'm pregnant. And he says, really, bro? Really, bro? That wasn't exciting at all. And we know that it was already pre-filmed and we knew it was a whole bunch of foolery and we knew it was a whole bunch of fuckery going on. So that was never a question. When they did the baby mama dance, he was looking like, who farted? Who burped? Who, you know, who cut the cheese and uh, didn't pass the crackers? He had his nose all twisted up and everything else, and he was not into it. Then she um, said, okay, well, baby's going to go get me a wig. Well, honey, first sign when you're in labor, right? And he knows you're going to be filming. He came back with the Pocahontas nappy needs to be a uh, pressed iron and curl wig. Remember when she did that iconic short, we're okay, me and the baby, and she was just looking, uh, whew, man, the word, look. Words have left my mouth. We all know what we're talking about, right? He wants you to continuously look like a fool. So then when is it going to come out? I'm waiting on the receipts that he don't got no job because we all know that, that he ain't about nothing. Now, let's just let, let, let's just sum this up, okay? In the past few months, let's just keep it all the way real. Let's just get a read. Jasmine, in the past few months, it has been exposed, number one, that he did not want the baby, okay? Number two, it has been exposed that um, there has been some violence in your home between you and him because a tripod was broken. There was some argument. There was some screaming, whatever happened. We have seen him do things that is immorally just corrupt around the children with the children. Okay, girl, what, what are you going to wait to come out with next? I'm going to tell you something. I'm going to tell you something. Ain't no way in common decency. See, what, what these mommies don't realize is a baby is supposed to be a blessing. When you're with someone and they're telling you in the you know real world, let's just say that, that they want to be with you. When you create a baby, a baby is something that is a bond of the two of you. Uh-huh. It's your DNA, day DNA, and, and it's something that you should love together. But we all knew it. Jasmine, 
When you said that Legendary had to have a helmet, no tea, no shade, did you see Chris's face? He was pulling away like, that ain't my baby. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Uh-uh. And I'm almost thinking when you came out and said, hey, I'm pregnant. He was, I, I mean, this is no tea, no shade, y'all. But he was sitting around looking at the other kids, and he probably was like, oh, my God, I'm having, about to have a baby by her. My genes are trapped in her. This cannot happen. Oh, my God, what is it going to happen? And then when the baby comes along and then there is problems with the baby, he's like, oh, Jesus, see, I knew it. I knew it. Oh, my. I want to back out. He won't even go out in public and keep the helmet on the baby. He rarely goes out in public with you. So, I mean, it, this is just foolery. I mean, guys, I am almost speechless with this one. I really am. I mean, receipts don't lie. I mean, Jasmine, you can get on here and you can tell us anything, but you better produce some receipts of a paycheck stub that this man at least got three jobs. At least you can then say, well, at least he takes care of our house and our home because right now, honey, it's just looking a mess. It's looking a mess. You're looking, a, this is crazy, y'all. This is cuckoo crazy. I mean, who would lay up there and tell a man I'm pregnant by you and then he's pushing you away? He don't want to cuddle. And she said he don't want to have no boom boom in the room no more. He don't want to be doing all of that because in case she gets pregnant. Girl, you trapped this man. You trapped him. I'm, I'm here to say it. It was a trap. You was telling us that you was going to get uh, birth control and you were being safe and you were being protected. Then y'all was having y'all late night wine, dine, dingly, dangly doo-doos. And he just slipped up. Y'all slipped up. It wasn't planned, as you said. It wasn't something that everybody was celebrating. It was a slip up. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. It wasn't a mix up. It was a slip up. <laughs> I love that song. Y'all, baby. Baby. How this woman can continue... To protect this man is beyond me. Do you hear me? The fact that she continues to protect his image, his legacy, and everything else is beyond me. Jasmine. Jasmine. Now, honey, we all know you were, uh, we knew this, okay? We all knew you were a little pressed for love and things. But, honey, this one, this one right here, this took the cake. Uh, y'all, did y'all see this? <laughs> Sometimes I really have to say, did y'all see this? Is it, am I seeing this? Is this true? Is this real? I'm in, I'm in shock, guys. I really am. I'm really in shock with this one because we all had the knowledge of it, right? We all thought, you know, something was a little off, something was a little iffy. But for it to really be true, Jasmine, Jasmine. I really can't wait to see when she addresses this. I really think this is going to be a topic that she is going to swerve and go around the corner and she's not going to do. She's going to tiptoe over because, honey, now that I'm thinking about it, your baby shower was a disaster. He was just sitting there like a bump on the log. It was a disaster. Your gender reveal was a disaster. Your baby daddy, this is, <laughs> this is the thing right here, y'all. She showed up in a dress. She dressed all the kids up, actually combed their hair, and stood out there, and all he did was throw a ball in his Nike slides and his basketball shorts. Honey, this is a red flag. Flag on the play. Flag on the play. All I got to say is I can't wait to see how this one unrumbles and unfumbles because this one right here, baby, see, this is what happened, Jasmine, when you jump in somebody else's business. You're continuously out here trying to stand up for Olivia, who is putting you in the midst of drama. Do you not get that? Do you not get that? Do you not get that Olivia is 95% of your problem? I guess not. But y'all, honey, we're going to talk about this in the comments because this is unbelievable.